In today's video, I'm gonna show you what it's like when a horse becomes cast in a stall. So this is one reason why I don't keep my horses in stalls. Muffin came in here, she laid down, tried to roll, and got stuck up against the wall. This is called cast. I know several horses that have died from being stuck in a stall at night, and who knows how long they were there before they were found like that. So luckily I'm right here and I can help her in this situation and get her out and I've got some help here with me. But so for, for those who've asked me many times over the years why I don't stall my horses, this is an excellent example. So in, in here I have pea gravel and it's a large area and she does love to roll in it but she just happened to put herself right up against the wall and got stuck. So we're gonna go ahead and get her out. In my experience, it sure can be scary when a horse gets cast in a stall, but with the correct approach, usually the horse turns out just fine. Um, what I've typically done before is we take and put um, a soft rope around the legs and just simply flip the horse back over. Um, in this case, it worked out really well because Muffin was actually able to get a grip on the bottom of the wall and she pushed herself just as we were about to go and help her and she managed to get far enough away from the wall to get her feet underneath her, so she was able to get back up again. But it can be super scary, and it's one of the reasons that I try not to stall my horses very often. And some horses just really like to lay down and roll in a stall. Um, not all of my stalls have gravel in them. That one does, and that is one that horses just really love to roll in. But I typically don't keep them in there at night. They're usually only in there when I'm around, so it's not so much of a big deal. But I do have horses who absolutely will lay down and roll in any stall of any size and any kind of, um, any kind of bedding or footing down, they don't care. So it's just a risk that we take as horse owners. But I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, be sure to give it a like, share it with your friends, and comment below. Let me know if you've ever been in this kind of a situation and had to rescue a horse that was cast in a stall before. Thanks so much for watching.